guys, so this video is a little bit overdue. A little while back, uh, SA Filament sent me some of their new filaments that they have been manufacturing, and they are truly gorgeous. Um, most of these are sort of a shimmer effect on the print, and we get stunning prints out of it. So thank you to SA Filament for sending me this stuff uh, for review, and I am impressed. I like it a lot. Um, Guys, I'm still working on some way to do a proper strength test of filaments, but for now, let's just talk about how these look so good. So yeah, these are great uh, filaments to print with, print really well. Uh, unusually, the temperature is a little bit higher than what I'm used to. Uh, usually I print PLA at about 200 to 205 degrees Celsius. These ones we printed at 215, so all of this was printed at 215, except this one was printed at 205. So that's why it's not as good as the rest of them. And due to that, um, it was an interesting it was an interesting experiment to find uh, the print range. I'd like to push the range a little bit higher and see how it goes and how they look. But guys, these these filaments are gorgeous. Okay, uh, the the shimmer. Which one is my favorite one? It was it was this one here. The shimmer that this gives off in the light is just stunning. I don't know if you can see that from the intro. You probably could have seen it quite well. Um, so over here we have got uh, this one here was the this one here is the chrome silver. It looks chrome. It looks gorgeous. Uh, this one I think is black like, on par for my favorite. This color here, which is your uh, blue chrome. It is just ah, oh, it is a gorgeous, gorgeous color. Um, and the shimmer is just amazing on the print. The print quality is amazing, and I really am very happy with the way these print. Uh, SA Filament do give it on the spool, or you can print your own spool, so you can get it spoolless, which is a great innovation. It reduces the cost a little bit. Um, and I store my PLA in, in bags. I always keep them in the bag with the their skin in there, and just make sure that uh, this doesn't get exposed to much water. PLA doesn't absorb a lot of water, so it's, um, it is it is better. It's not hydroscopic like your pet G's and your ABS's. Your ABS, really, you have to store uh, in, a, in a really dry environment. Now, speaking of that dry environment, uh, SA Filament also sent me their container. I think this is a great idea. Um, it holds two spools. Uh, so you put your ABS's and your pet G's and your, your stuff that is more hydroscopic, that wants to absorb more water. Um, and this, I think, is a great, great innovation. It comes nitrogen filled. I cannot confirm if it's nitrogen filled, but that's how it comes to me before you break the seal. Once you break the seal, obviously, it's going to be more oxygen inside here. But if you just keep this skin inside you, it'll keep your filament nice and dry. I think that's a great innovation. What do you guys think? Um, so, yeah, I've really enjoyed printing with these filaments and... I'm looking forward to see what, what more is coming out from SA Filament. Go check out their website. I'll put the link below to their website. Go check them out. And uh, yeah, happy printing, guys. Good luck and God bless you. And stay well, stay safe. Thanks for watching.